This is the life. So tell me, Jesse, what do you make of the new kid? Barack Obama to me is the best of what they're offering us because he's new, he's got fresh ideas, but he's still going to get his strings pulled by the Democratic Party. That's true. He's talking about all this change. There won't be change happening. Look at, okay, 2006, the voters clearly sent a mandate to the spineless Democrats. They sent a mandate to them saying, get us out of Iraq. Have they done it? No. So what do we do? We need a revolution to get rid of the Democratic and Republican two-party dictatorship that goes on in this country. A revolution. I like the sound of that. Tell me, do you remember our old friend Alex Jones? Yeah. We've been working on a little project together. Tell me, what is your opinion of the U.S. Constitution? I believe in the Constitution. Of course you do. But are you willing to fight for it? Give me liberty or give me death. That's what I wanted to hear. Listen, I'm going to ask you a small favor. Head up to Jonestown and tell Dennis Kucinich that I'll be on my way shortly. already shown that defendants are clearly guilty of multiple war crimes. However, if it pleases the court, I would like to call a co-counsel to help represent my case. That's rather unconventional, but I'll allow it. I swear to God he's retarded, he can barely speak English. How did this dick ever get to be president to begin with? Idiot in chief, thinking he's above the law. Did everything short of killing a baby on the White House lawn. And got off scot-free, never faced prosecution. Wiping his ass with the Constitution. Replacing propaganda in a place of facts. And who would have thought he'd be a homicidal maniac? He killed hundreds and thousands, maybe a million. Innocent civilians, women and children ran up trillions in debt. And let's not forget the WMDs. Did they find them yet? Or was that just one of W's conspiracy theories? Now I ran as a nuclear program. Oh, really? You'll forgive me if I don't believe a word you say. Like any detainee from Guantanamo Bay. Dick mixing politics with religion. A Patriot Act is an attack on patriotism. You got FEMA, Katrina, and I could go on. But dude's done more shit than I can fit in one song. So if you set out to be a traitor and a jerk and a most miserable failure on the face of the earth and make the place Worst the whole time you're in office, then I'm thinking it's safe to say mission accomplished. First president ever! Yes, he was! Worst president ever! Dude, you suck! Let it be said, Worst let it be known, let history stay and let the record show he was the worst president ever! Oh, that is some pretty damning evidence. Do you have anything to say in your own defense? I built a little empire out of some crazy garbage called the blood of the exploited working class. But they've overcome their shyness Now they're calling me your highness And the world screams Kiss me, son of God I destroyed a bond of friendship and respect Between the only people left who even look me in the eye Now I laugh and make a fortune Off the same ones that I tortured And the world screams Kiss me, son of God. Objection. Sustained. In the case of Earth versus Bush and his cronies, has the jury reached a verdict? Guilty. Mr. Bush, in light of your total disdain for America, and for having made Texans look like jackasses these past eight years, I hereby sentence you to life in prison without the possibility of parole. And as for your cronies, I hereby demand they enlist in the U.S. Army and deploy to Afghanistan immediately.
Death to the liberal Hollywood elite. Death to all those who dare question Fox News. Kill the liberals. Burn their city to the ground. Spit on the ashes. Spit on them. Shut up, you blubbering fool. Do you realize how much those Hannity bots cost me? <sighs> Scared of you? Don't make me laugh. I'm Robert fucking Murdoch. I control newspapers, television, and my own movie studio. As far as you are concerned, I am the media. 40% of this pathetic country will believe whatever bullshit I feed them. By this time tomorrow, you will be the most hated man in America. The masses will be screaming for your blood. You and your little wench too. But of course, if you would prefer to settle this with violence, I'd be happy to oblige you. Mr. Jones, mark my words, Murdoch will pay for what he did here today. The streets will run red with the blood of his henchmen. We will slaughter them, like animals, and lay waste to their entrails. What the hell am I supposed to do now? We have an army, but no clear enemy to attack. I know I must kill the Federal Reserve, but it won't be easy. As a matter of fact, I think you'll find killing the bank is quite easy. The hard part is making sure it stays dead. Welcome, good doctor. We have been expecting you. You've been expecting me? Certainly. Did you expect we would turn our back on the country we founded? No, sir. We love this country. After all, we created it. But we are patriots, not saints. The enemies of liberty will stop at nothing to destroy you. But it is not violence you must fear, but rather, the manipulation of yourself. May the spirit of liberty guide you. May the spirit of liberty guide you. <laughs>